drugs. Like, why would you say that rock stars do so many more drugs than, say, people in the industrial adhesive industry? <laughs> Best, best guess I can give for it is uh, there is a social aspect to it because you spend a lot of time sitting around. There is the idea that if you're playing whoever you're playing on stage, you can sustain that longer. And then there's other things, which is uh, like, you know, the guys in the crew, Molly Crew would tell you, you get so high on stage that you want the show to go on off stage. Is that of course kind of generally covered? Absolutely. Well, yeah. Also, you can afford it. Oh, yeah. And also, people offer it to you. People like go out of their way as a way to curry favor with the band by getting them not just the best drugs, they get them the best everything. That's a way to like ingratiate yourself yeah, we with had a, a famous person. Here's the best pot ever. Yeah, we had a guy once, um, it was when we were still pretty young, but the guy came backstage and he said... Uh, does anyone have any weed? And our roadie at the time, he was the weed guy, right? I said, well, that guy. And so he goes, uh, if you can get me some weed, I've got liquid LSD. Okay, we just met this guy. Well, LSD is always liquid. No, you can take it in a paper tab. That's well, that's, but that's putting a drop of the liquid. Yeah, but I'm saying it. is we'd never taken pure liquid LSD. Well, you certainly wouldn't want to take more than a drop or two. Hold on, that's the beginning of the story. So we just met this guy. And so we go, wait, so if he, the guy over in the corner, doesn't know he's about to give up his pot, who works for us, if he gives you pot, you'll give us this liquid LSD. He goes, yeah. So we go to the guy, you got to give him some weed. He's like, well, I don't want to. I, uh, no, you're going to give him the weed. So we, he makes make him give his weed. And the guy literally, I just met this guy. We literally went like this, and he filled our hands, and we I, I must take like 25 hits of LSD. Just came off stage. How old were you when this happened? 22. And what happened? You tripped your brains out for... You could have died. Fucking two days. But that's what I'm saying. That was, I'm getting to your point about drugs being available. You just meet some stranger. Hey, man, take this liquid. Well, now, go, you've, go, go, go. now you've also explained another um, thing about rock life, which is why there are so many ODs. And I think the answer is because when you're young like that, you're a fucking idiot yeah. and you'll and of course the combination of being a fucking idiot plus a, the easily available high potency drugs yeah yeah you're we, gonna we have, lived it we yeah. lived it i mean we we had no i, I remember, we've had overdoses and people die and all of it we've i remember it doing it's, things, and it's horrible doing things that when i look back i'm like wow my god there, there was i remember in college you know we're experimenting with everything there was something that went around and it was, I guess it was what now they call poppers. Mm. You know, like in the gay community, it was a big thing to, yeah. you'd have to, and you'd kind of snap it. This thing would snap. Yeah, amyl, amyl nitrate. Right? Amyl nitrate. And you, if, <clears throat> you know, and you, you'd take a big snort of it. Okay, so we had it in this little vial. It was, it was like a little vial of, what would, same thing with acid. If you drank it, you'd die. But what you just take the top off mm, uh -huh. and then snort and then put it. But if we like got too high and forgot and drank it instead of the, or said, hey, I wonder what would happen if you drink this. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I, because it was such a stupid drug. You'd get incredibly beet red. Your heart would go a trillion miles an hour. You'd laugh your ass off for like two minutes and then it'd be over. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like, hey, thanks for watching the clip. Hit the subscribe button now so you never miss out on our club random content that's posted daily.